Now, from the University of Okaboji, it's Okaboji Broadcast with Jeff D. Welcome to Okaboji Broadcast, everybody. I'm Jeff D. coming to you from our studios right here, Historic Arnold's Park Amusement Park, with me from the Pearson Lakes Art Center. The uh, live performance director, Rochelle Fratsky, is here with us. Hello, hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Are you, good. Are you glad it's warm weather and we're... I am. I am. And I, I'm anxious to get going too because it's been a long winter and it, I it just has want been. to get going. <laughs> it, that's something, isn't it? That it's a we never say, well it was a short winter. We never <laughs> no, no we don't one say says that. that. <laughs> but we're glad to get back to the into the warm weather performance schedule right, right. there at Pearson Lakes Art Center. Right. Uh, and we're not wasting any time before we get out of May here. Right. We are. A we favorite. Are. A favorite. Uh, are you talking about Bat? Uh, I'm talking about Bat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, he's a lot of people's favorite. Oh we pack gosh. that room in when he's here. And they keep saying, do you want to go upstairs? No, I like it, Pat. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I was there last year and such a... And people have been down there in Gulf Shores right. where he kind of... And uh, always say, it, you know, don't say, well, I've seen him. There's not... The same show, no, ever. Never. He's, he, a, he's he, such an entertainer. He, he, he knows how to read the crowd and do what the crowd wants. Yeah, and, and you sing along with him, and you just have a great time. He is so much, so yeah. much fun. He so is. when is he here? Then he's now? here on May twenty eighth. Okay, next Tuesday. Next Tuesday. Yeah. But before that, another tradition that uh, goes uh, way back there at the tradition. art center. Yeah, and you got the band coming back. Yeah, band. yeah, the. Uh, Dick Baum and Bing Band yeah. starts on Monday night, Memorial Day. So, and that and that's that, downstairs in the Ridge as yes, well. Yes, it is. Okay. Yeah. yeah, from Memorial Day to Labor Day every Monday night. So, just <laughs> as sure as clockwork, yeah. isn't it? You know, the big band's <laughs> going to be there on Monday night. Yeah. yeah. Well, right. So we've got uh, that, and then that, and that'll kind of does that kind of take care of May there? That's then? May. Okay. Yeah, well, except for celebrate the arts is uh, Friday. May 31st. Oh my gosh. Yeah. You're we packing a lot in yeah, the last yeah, few we, days. I, we changed it from Saturday to Friday, so we thought maybe we'd see if people liked that any yeah. better. So. Only one way to find out is try. Exactly. 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 They don't have to get off the water on Saturday. Then. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely thought. Yes. Well played there, Rochelle. Yeah. So. so, but then we do get into the month of June. We do. Yeah. June is packed as well. Yes. I have my first shows are Hotel California. Oh. You know, they're back for about the seventh or eighth year. But that's Two okay. Two shows and they're already almost filled. I was going to say, you know, just, you know when yeah. it's a when it's per, a perennial favorite, yeah. bring them back and let people yeah. enjoy them again. Exactly. June 11th and 12th. It always amazes me because I think... Oh, when should we change it back to one night? And it's like, no, they're packing in two nights. You so. may have to go to three before you go yeah, to well, one. That's well, what, that's what George told me. He said, you want us to stay another night? And I'm going, eh, maybe, but not yeah. this year. Yeah, not this year. <laughs> so uh, tickets, there's still some. but There's uh, still some. Okay. Yeah, yeah but they're not going to last much longer. Right, exactly. So, so what follows uh, what the follows Eagles that, tribute? Um, a, commo- a band called Commotion. Okay. They're a CCR tribute band. Oh yeah. The special thing about this one, though, is if you if anybody remembers Jimmy Ryan, mm-hmm. who was the uh, inductee well, an inductee last year at the Iowa Hall of Fame, mm-hmm. and did a show at our place, he he is coming back with that band. Oh, how fun! And he was so awesome by himself that I can't imagine this isn't going to be just great. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, yeah. And and that great hard, CCR sound. Yeah, yeah, it's hard to find CCR tributes. So, oh man, this will be good. Iconic, iconic yeah. music. All yeah. right. Yeah. Most of our shows are Tuesdays this year. It's just when we have two nights, it's Tuesday, Wednesday. So, yeah, yeah. It's good. It's consistent. At least. Yes, exactly. But, the next show, <laughs> Live at Laurel Canyon, is on June 25th. Okay. They are a 60s, 70s band. They were here last year. Everybody loved them. So they're coming back. Plus, the next night, on the 26th, mm-hmm. they're doing a show dedicated to James and Joni. 
Oh. So it'll be all James and Joni songs. How nice. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. awesome. It'll be yeah. Good. How yeah. fun could that be? <laughs> that'll be great. Yes. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Does that so kind of round out our that, June? That's enough for June. That's June 25th, 26th. Okay. So. And of course, uh, tickets are available at uh, lakesart.org. Yeah. And, but you can also stop into the box office right. And, right. and get them that way. And so, yeah. well, you're, you're, you're starting out wonderfully here to end may you it's got a strong. lot to end may yep. get through june and next time you come back we'll be talking july but yeah i'd like to mention one other show yeah. it's it's um someone who contacted me it's called wild wind wild prairie winds okay and they are a string group yeah do chamber music and Ooh. they are coming they're doing four shows the first one on June 4th okay. will be in our gazebo for families and children. Oh, yeah. And then they do a couple other shows in the community, and the last one they're doing is a, a master's performance in the Lordson Theater. Oh, wow. And that's on June 7th. All right. So I'm really looking for... I mean, this is music we don't get every well, exactly. day, so well, it, it'll be and, exciting. And that's what makes so many of these, you know, that... Uh, You've got your niche there, you know, mm -hmm. and you've got your, you know, your theaters that are perfect for these different groups. Yeah. And you do it on nights when people don't traditionally have a lot of other things, you know. That, Try, yeah. <laughs> but, but you've come in, you've been selling out so many shows over the last yeah. couple of years that, yes. uh, I, you know, definitely on a roll. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we are. So and, the, you know, i got to say, I'm looking forward to seeing people again yes, this year. Yes, yes. <laughs> It's darn time as we yes. start seeing some people and, <laughs> and no coats on and all that good exactly. stuff. All right. Exactly. Rochelle, thank you for coming in and we'll, we'll see you here in about a month. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Rochelle Frasky again, the Performing Arts Director, our Pearson Lakes Arts Center. We thank her for her time. We thank you for watching us right here on Okaboji Broadcast. Okaboji Broadcast from the studios at Historic Arnold's Park Amusement Park is brought to you in part by West Wealth Management, a financial advisory practice of Ameriprise Financial Services, advisor Jan Spielman, A.J. Spielman, and Erica Wachholz. The headquarters of the University of Okaboji is at the Three Suns, open Monday through Saturday 10 to 5 and Sunday from 10 to 4. Bank Midwest, dream big, plan wisely, live well. Lakes Regional Healthcare and Avera Partner. Beck Engineering in Spirit Lake. Be Radiant Laser Skin Studio in the Okaboji Plaza in Okaboji. 